Hello, I'm going to show you quite a complicated example here and we're going to use a variable to control this dog's behavior. Now this dog here, this little blue dog, has got two types of behavior, walking and standing. This is standing, just standing still. And walking, um, if you look here, he's going to move three steps and I've got three costumes in here and two of the costumes are just going to alternate dog B and dog C are going to alternate and each time it's going to wait a second and just move three steps so that it looks like he's walking so that's the dog walking and that's the dog standing what I've got to do now is control the behavior and um, the way I'm going to control it is when you click on the dog it's going to change the behavior um, to walk or stand accordingly. Now if you look here I've, I've already created a variable and it's a um, just a, a normal variable um, specific just to the dog. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start the dog off walking when I click um, and so I'm going to bring up this uh, if clause I'm going to put it inside the forever loop and I'm going to do all the walking behavior only if that variable is set to walk so if you look here uh, when I click the green button it's going to change the variable to, to walk and he's going to start walking and there he is now if I uh, set the variable back to stand he's going to stop uh, we haven't quite put in the stand behavior yet but if I just put that in there uh, you can see let's start him off he's gonna start walking uh, and then as soon as we change that to stand he's standing and if we get him walking again um, that's great so all we got to do now is do this little bit of logic here which when I click the dog if it's on walk it's gonna change it to stand and if it's on stand it's gonna change it back to walk so now if I just click on the dog stands and he walks stands and he walks stands and he walks now you could do that with a broadcast I'm just doing it with a click so the thing you should take away from this is you can have a, a variable that uh, you can put a piece of text in it so there's a word there that's telling you what the state of the dog is and it's telling you whether the dog is standing or walking and then inside your forever loop you can just have a simple if if behavior equals walk or if behavior equals stand you could have lots of those ifs in there and you could control the different types of behavior um, that the dog has and that's actually a principle in uh, some people's uh, design of robots uh, where they just make uh, the robot do one behavior at a time and you've just done that with a variable